All right, we have a lot to take a look at in this match um, because this is Salamangrate. Now, I haven't fully learned the deck as much as possible, and Justin down here is also looking like he's learning his first time through as well. It's one of the reasons why I wanted to look at this because it's not necessarily a bad thing to kind of watch as other people are progressively learning as well. And this is for the first round of this month's OCG tournament. So we opened up Lady Debug, Max C of Foxy, Desires, and another Lady Debug. All right. Well, our opponent is trying to do BA things. Uh, what is it with everybody in an OCG tournament, by the way, wanting to play Burning Abyss? Like, it, it always amazes me just how much there actually is of this. Uh, now, we did draw into Salaman Great Roar, which is the counter trap card um, when you control a link, and if you do, you know, destroy the card. <laughs> I fucking love this card. So, we drew the Salaman Great Circle, which will act as our core rota. Our opponent ends up milling off malicious. Well, I mean, had we not had the Max C, we might have had some really big effects coming our way here. So, Rhino going ahead to mill off. Uh, Sulkius, kind of, once again, setting up for the next turn, because, I mean, what more can you do? So we're drawing into turn, and we drew Gazelle. All right, well, I assume that we're going to start with Lady Debug, because she is absolute. oh, excuse me, we got to start with the Rota first. So I'm going to declare the add from deck to hand function. So Rota getting to resolve, adding the... Mr. Spinny. If you control Solomon Great, you can discard this card. Target one. Control Solomon Great monster other than Spinny, you can special summon this card. So, we're going to normal summon our Spinny. And of course, this is so dumb, by the way. For, for those of you that uh, haven't seen much about Solomon Great, they have a Link one, which is actually uh, Violinix. So, if this card is Link summoned, um, <laughs> you can add one Solomon Great section where you redeck your hand. So, a gazelle of a Salaman Great Monster sent to your graveyard, except for a Gazelle, you can special summon this card from your hand. So we have Link's Chain Link 1. Chain Link 2 is the Gazelle on standby. So we're going to go ahead and start resolving. Um, we're getting to add the Sanctuary from our deck to our hand. Ooh. And then out comes the Gazelle on resolution. So a Gazelle. <laughs> if this card is normal social media, you can send one Salaman Great card from your deck to the graveyard, except for Gazelle. And you can only use each effect of Gazelle once per turn. So this is where you dump off the Rage. Um, send one Salaman Great monster from your hand or face field to the graveyard, target one card, they feel destroy it. When you target Link monster, controls Link summoned using a monster with the same name, and destroy cards your opponent controls up to that card's Link rating. Spinny going to do what Spinny wants to do best. Um, he gets to go ahead and special summon himself back from the graveyard, but, I mean, he's going to banish himself. But we don't care about that because we get to just overlay. Why did they give this deck a lane three? Mirage Dahlia is going to detach, special summon one from my deck, uh, but you cannot activate monster effects for this in turn except for light monsters. And if this guy is sent to the graveyard for material, you can target one monster in your graveyard and return it to your hand. <laughs> so free, by the way. Oh, it comes our boy Jack Jaguar. If you control Salaman Great Link Monster while this card is in your graveyard, you target one Salaman Great in your graveyard, except for Jack Jaguar. Shuffle that target into the deck, and if you do, special summon this card. Oh, God. All right. Well, we're going to now activate Sanctuary. You can use one Salaman Great Link Monster to control with material. Um, <laughs> and uh, do some fun stuff. Here we go. Now, this is the guy that comes out next set. This is Sunlight Wolf. So... If a monster is normal special to a zone that this card points to, you can add one fire monster from your graveyard to your hand, but for the rest of this turn, you cannot normal summon special summon monsters with that name. If this card was Link Summoned using a Salaman Grave Sunlight Wolf, you can add one Salaman Great spell or trap card from your graveyard to your hand. You can only use each effect of this guy once per turn. So, kind of doing some great things here. So, well... Continuing on up along with our day here. <laughs> Yay, Link Summons. Well, if you Link Summon a Salaman Great Monster, you can use one Salaman Great Monster you control with the same name as the entire material. So once again, we're transferring material on top of material. And which actually does what we need to do. So Sunlight Wolf toggling into Sunlight Wolf. Uh, why does this exist? We get back our rage that we dumped. 
Foxy doing what Foxy wants to do for the excavation. Once again, also, like, why why do we get things like this? <sighs> so fucking... Uh, this, this whole Dex, like, toolbox engine that it has going for it is so adorably cute. Like, sitting too. Fucking gonna link summon Phoenix. And then Desires. Fucking just turbo. I mean, we can't do 8,000 to our opponent, but, I mean, setting up a negation and rage for, like, two pops, things like that. This hand is so good. Hello, Stratos. I'm talking about how he, like, messed up somewhere. I mean, just for, like, basic intents and purposes of watching this, like, for basic combos and things like that. Hello, or Mr. Hydralander. And then r raging it down. Taking care of that. Malicious for the special. Another orbital Hydralander. <laughs> Thanks for killing all of our stuff. Makes me feel good about my life. Our opponent rolls on into Boral Sword <laughs> with Terror Top. Um, <laughs> Thanks, guy. Like, our opponent is just doing work over here. Overlaying into Dante for the fresh mill three. Yeah. That's uh, going to be the little thing that we like to call game, quite possibly. Yep. Thanks for putting damage on the board for us. Well, we lost game one because of Boral Sword Dragon, but that's cool. Because now we get to play the game again. Foxy for the center spinning, overlaying into Mirage Stalio, which will get us Jack Jaguar. I like how we kind of had to waste our dump functionality into this guy. Welcome back our friend. Our friend recurring back Gazelle and we unfortunately have to end there. That's not a very strong hand. But I'm trying to evenly us judgmenting it so we don't have to actually lose the game to some unformidable needs. Skarm coming on down with Graf and Dante, Milling some good cards. Paul Call by the Grave gets us back to the next turn. And now we can kind of Start playing the game as we saw fit. I'm actually kind of surprised that uh, he didn't do this like last turn um, with this, but I mean, this also, eh, I guess it's arguable. Sanctuary coming to our hand, milling off, rotating into Heat Leo, special summon all the friends, style Leo, comboing back up. This is so dumb watching this deck. Well, we've made double Heat Leo now, so this card is Link Summoned. Target one card in your opponent's spell trap cards and shuffle into the deck. And once returned to your main face, this card is Link Summoned using Heat Leo. Target one face of monster on the field and one monster in your graveyard. The attack of the first target becomes equal to the other target's attack. This isn't necessarily too amazing, but I mean, it, it puts pressure on the field. Hello, Skarm. For the tour guide, Terra Top. Oh, our opponent is just really good at this game. It would seem. Well, hey. Hello, Roar. Salaman Greats, Roar. And Cherubini. Getting killed off. Our opponent just scoops. Alright, we're going to the, the hot game three now. Where we actually can kind of do things. Not really. I see I see a Brickosaurus Rex. There's enough bricks here to build a house. <laughs> Well, Maxi's a really good card. That's what I always learn about these OCG matches. Oh, he boarded in evenly. What a champion. Yeah, you just pass on this hand. Hey, we drew Prankatops. That's pretty good. Slam that Desires on the table and hope we draw some good stuff. That's kind of what this has to do. I mean, our opponent... Oh, hello, Lady Debug and Spinny. What the fuck? Those were amazing. As long as he didn't mill, like, a crucial piece, like... Alright. Oh, yeah, by the way, you can just do that. It's one level four lower cybers monster. So you could just toggle on into uh, Valenix. <laughs> That's so dumb. Setting up the sanctuary now. Let the fun begin. Hello, Spinny. Hello, Gazelle. Hello, Gazelle. I'm getting to special summon. Oh my gosh, this is so dumb. Alright, we got the Will of the Salaman Great coming to our hand. I'm going to go ahead and toggle now. Setting up 
I'm getting to recur back the will. So during your main phase, you can special one solid man great from your hand or graveyard and send this face of card from your field to the graveyard, then target one solid man great link of monster you control that was linked summoned using a monster the same name as a material. Solid man great monsters oh with the same name as material. Solid man great monster monsters from your hand or graveyard position up to the number of link ratings. You can only use one will of the solid man great once per turn. This card's actually really fucking good. Like, they gave this deck just the bare minimum. Once again, like, I think our opponent kind of starts to lose now at this point because, like, we have double D-Barrier and Impermanence. Like, Will coming down here. Oh, man. Well, we get to just skeet skeet now. Attack. Attack. Set D-Barrier, set Impermanence. Offer the Handshake. Orbital Hydrolander coming on down. Why does this card, like, just try to ruin our day? Like... <laughs> oh, man. Well... Hydra... Hydra's such an annoying ass card. D-bearing for our opponent. Suck is lighting. Uh, our opponent has Torgot, but I mean, like... Cool, you're under D-bear. Impermanence for the lockout of this. We should still literally have game next turn. Like, I, I don't see any... There's, like, no... Wow, they're just strudoing. Oh, my. <laughs> Maxi on the destru... When you have everything, you literally have everything. And that's the thing that I kind of like about Solid Man Great. Like, overall, like, the deck is one hell of a resource generator. Like, I definitely think that I kind of want to play the deck second. Like, I, I don't know if I know the deck well enough yet to say that, but, like, it's very interesting... Oh, our opponent made Yazi. That's interesting. Oh no, our friend died. Oh wow, he he didn't have a target <laughs> for the special, and that's where the scoop comes in. Overall, though, this is just kind of meant to showcase a little bit of what Salamangrate can actually do to kind of like show you guys what's going on. Please so comment down below, tell me what you guys think, and well, guys, I'm out. The ride never. Well, truly ends. Thank you, patrons. Without you guys, I don't know what I'd be wearing in these videos. I might be a truffle shuffle and all over again. Guys, please also check out Vancol40 for some awesome banger content. Some other interesting stuff you might find up here on the left or in the description as well. Thanks for watching.